Jorge Prado with the foxhole shot. Roman Febvre that has to be on the green. Kawasaki in second, and it is. And this place will erupt, but he gets passed by Siwa immediately from Switzerland. That's the pass that got him in the uh, in the qualifying race yesterday by Jet Lawrence. Febvre leads on lap six. And Roxon. Roxon up the inside, moves into third. Ah, oh, squeezes into the right-hand side. Not a lot of leg room there. Prado pushing Fevre once again and squeezes him out on the exit. Ah, oh, it's all gone quiet over there on the hillside as Prado goes through and leads once again. Out of the final turn, he takes a look over his shoulder and Roma Fevre repeats what he did in 2015. He wins race one here at Erne at the Monster Energy Motocross of Nations. And you can see what it means to the former world champion. Here's how the riders line up then. France with pole position based on their low score in the qualifying races yesterday. Uh, France go to the line ahead of Spain, Australia, Germany, Switzerland, the USA six, Belgium seven, Slovenia, the Netherlands and Italy. RJ Hampshire with a good jump immediately, but he gets he squeezed. Got squeezed by Fernandez there. 27, Valentin Guillaume slides his way through. Christian Craig, oh, riders upside down. And number 14, Lucas Koonin in there. The Swede is in there as well, number 35, Philip Benson. But who else got caught out in that melee? Christian Craig around the outside. He's emerging just behind the 15 of Everts. But it's uh, Maxim Renault in there in sixth place. Where is Tom Biel? Did Biel go down in that carnage? He's in sixth. Oh, what happened there to Hunter Lawrence? Did he just catch the bank front end first? Evans and Fial fighting over this, what, uh, third, fourth place now. They He's alongside, hard. looks down at Fernandez as he flies over his head. Renault leads on lap 10. Ruben Fernandez who throws it away from one side of the track to the other, and he goes down. But uh, Maxim Renault, he wants to win. So too does Vial. Either way, it's going to be a French 1-2. It does not get any better than this. Maxim Renault, Tom Vial, first and second in race two. Where is the jump going to come from? I'll take the 16. 16 and 7 right in there, and Kenny's in there as well. It's Ken Roxon with the foxhole shot. Give you a quick rundown then, Lawrence. Australia leads Ken Roxon by more than two seconds. They've just completed their 10th lap, 3.3 as they go through this time around. Renault is here in third for France. France having a phenomenal run across the nations here. Couple corners to go. Takes a long look over his shoulder. The Australian bounces back with the win in the final race. It's going to be good enough to put Australia on the podium. Second overall, their best ever finish in this event. Jet Lawrence wins race three. Ken Roxon will cross the line second. Renault hangs on to third. France are world champions once again. The second time they do this on home soil. Maxim Renault. Tom Vial, Roman Fevre, world champions here in France.